it is given in the problem that there is a current of 1.2 ampere he is passing into this circuit you can see these three resistors are in parallel so being in parallel the current will be distributed across them as different parts i1 i2 and i3 all of them will again combine together and reach this point and becomes 1.2 ampere our problem is what is the current passing through this 15 ohms that's what the current is or that's what the problem is what is the current passing through 15 ohms that's the question so for that as as we have noticed that this 10 ohms 15 ohms and 30 ohms are in parallel what happens when the resistors are in parallel is they will have a same voltage but the current is distributed v equal to ir that is same it implies i into r is constant or i is inversely proportional to r that implies i1 is to i2 is to i3 is 1 by r1 is to 1 by r2 is to 1 by r3 this we have to decode further and find out the values of i1 i2 and i3 particularly i have to find out i2 so continuing that i1 is to i2 is to i3 is 1 by r1 r1 is 10 ohms is to 1 by r2 that is 15 ohms 1 by r3 is 30 ohms so by cancelling 5 we can further simplify 1 by 2 is to 1 by 3 is to 1 by 6 that's the ratio of the currents i1 is to i2 is to i3 means what out of the total current 1 by 2 part of the total current is shared across i1 1 by 3 is shared across i2 out of the total current 1 by 6 is shared across i3 taking that into consideration we need to find out what's the value of that uh, i2 is so you can say the value of the i2 is 1 by 3 of total current this is i2 because the ratio is 1 by 3 for the second what's the total current is first current 1 by 2 percent second current 1 by third ratio third over current 1 by 1 by 6 ratio of the total i2 i need to simplify it to get the value of i2 that is 1 by 3 of let's find the lcm for this you know the lcm of 2 3 and 6 hopefully you have learned in your schools that 2 3 and 6 3 is a common factor 2 won't get a uh, cancel so 3 ones and 3 twos have to multiply all of them 2 into 2 is 4 4 and 3 is 12 so the lcm of this is 12 so 2 and 12 2 6 times is 12 3 4 times is 12 6 2 times is 12 so that into i So simplifying that further, I two equal to one by third of twelve. Six plus four is ten, and ten uh, plus two is twelve. This is twelve by twelve. Both of them gets cancelled. A five. So what's our uh, final answer is? I by two is equal to one by third. This is got cancelled. That's equal to one. A five. It is given that the total I value is 1.2, so 1 by 3 of 1.2. That's nothing but equal to 0.4 amperes. That's how I can get a value of uh, I2. You can get any value. In fact, say for example, though I am not calculating, if you want the value of I3, I3 is 1 by 6 ratio, 1 by 6 of total current. That means summation of all that. Ratios 1 by 2 plus 1 by 3 plus 1 by 6 of the total current I that is 1.2 amperes. If you do that, I will get the value of I3. If I want an I1, we can write a value of 1 by 2 by sum of all the currents 1 by 2 plus 1 by 3 plus 1 by 6 of total current I. By writing any of these equations, 
we can get any of the currents in the circuit by taking a simple concept into consideration that in parallel voltage is same current is reciprocal of resistance that's it